Well, folks, you are looking at my tent cut. It is the oversized version. As you can see, I've got the four outside windows are open. Uh, all the flaps are open. Only the no see bug screens are closed. They're on all four sides. You just saw a bug flying right by there. There's a lot of bugs out here today. Uh, this is a campsite I've been to before. I've had a couple of cars drive by here. It's close to sundown. I don't know, maybe another 30 minutes or so. We're in the nice time of day. There's a great fire ring. Fortunately, I have no wood. This is the Mojave National Preserve. You are not, it is strictly forbidden to pick up vegetation or to chop vegetation, chop wood down, trees down. You can't do any of that. Uh, that's my new combination light and fan at the end of the bumper. And that is pretty heavy, but supposedly this tent cut has a place to hook to it in the ceiling. So we'll see. Ah, nectar of the gods. Our thermos. It's got a full cup. That's the Morongo Mobile. And looking over there, that's Kessler Peak. The plan was actually to get my drone out and fly it about right now. But I gotta be totally honest with you folks, I really do not feel like getting it out. I, I'm exhausted. <laughs> I'm really exhausted. I think I, I brought a tablet with a couple of movies on it. I'm probably gonna lay inside this tent cot, which by the way has a pad built in, but I've got a thermo rest also. I expect to have a good sleep, and this time I did not forget to bring my pillow. But I hope to have a good sleep tonight. I need it desperately. One more thing before I shut this off. Every other time I've been camping, I've pushed those seats forward that you see there, and it makes a flat spot in the back. But unfortunately, I'm five foot ten, and it's too short and my legs end up sticking out and hanging over the edge unless I, you know, go catty-cornered, which is kind of hard to do diagonally with a thermarest, which is way longer. So I'm hoping tonight I don't have that problem.